Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be talking about again one specific product that actually is just being extremely uh, rumored, extremely room, yeah, extremely rumored right now. And the thing behind this is that even though it's a rumor, it is a very, very, very logical and reasonable rumor with some good stuff backing it up. But before we get into that, I have to show you guys this. I have been absolutely addicted to this PewDiePie app. Um, he just he just released this app. It's like a YouTube simulator, and it is so fun. Uh, add me on it if you guys are playing it. Uh, my name is... I can't remember what my name was. Billy's Backyard, one word. Uh, add me on it. It's super fun. <laughs> but anyways, back to the original topic here. I'm talking about Destiny 2, and myself as a player of Destiny, I played it for a couple years. I never got too into it with the expansion packs and all of that. It kind of just seemed a little bit too expensive for me. And I told myself I'm not going to get too much into the expansions once they come out. And apparently a lot of other people are thinking that exact same way as well. Let me explain a little bit here. Destiny released the game, Destiny. And what they have been doing, rather than releasing a new title, they have been releasing um, expansions, yearly expansions usually. And people like them, some of them are not as good as others, people still buy them, everything's cool with it. And recently, the Destiny 2 rumors have been surfacing quite a bit with some reasonable people talking about it. NeoGAF talked about it, they have backed it up really really good with some really nice information. And the reason why it's time to have Destiny make a new title is the following. It, it, it appeals to me quite a bit because there are a lot of people that haven't played Destiny yet. So think about it like this. Destiny is a game that is yearly expanding with expansion packs. And if there are people that have never played Destiny before and they jumped into it, they bought whatever amount of money they put into Destiny right away, they might get a little bit lost. Uh, there's so many people that are so far ahead of them that it's kind of not really making too much sense to start right now. And because there are a lot of people that have never played Destiny and are slowly starting to get into it right now and just putting the game down right away because the skill set is bad, uh, the information behind it, they, they don't want to put all of the effort into uh, researching everything, the weapons, the guns, the good stuff, the whatever you really need to do to get into Destiny. People aren't doing that as much as they were back when Destiny was really new. So, the game cannot rely on yearly expansions anymore. At all. They can't do it. It's not working as well as it was. All of the old players can still enjoy it, but the new ones really can't enjoy it and get fulfilled as much as they want them to. So Activision and Bungie know this, and they're starting to put a lot of effort into a new title. And I'm not talking uh, a Destiny 2. I'm talking about, uh, it is Destiny 2, but it's going to be a completely new title. Things like new weapons, new characters, new loot, etc. All of that is something that they need to do to be able to bring new players in and to appeal to also the seasoned players because seasoned players are still going to really want to get into a new Destiny game, a Destiny 2, and new players that might be a little bit intimidated by the expansion packs and the knowledge that people have behind Destiny right now, those people are able to start something fresh, start something new, and understand it and learn alongside seasoned Destiny players. Do you see what I'm trying to get at here? A game like Destiny is something that a lot of uh, game titles are starting to do nowadays. Look at games like um, Overwatch is I think going to be doing this. Rather than them going out and putting money into a brand new title, they can put effort into expansion packs, uh, new characters, uh, put a lot of effort into making Overwatch a game that they want it to be, but if Overwatch does this for as long as Destiny has been doing it, People that have never played Overwatch are going to want to get into it, but they're like, hey, I really don't understand Overwatch that much, and they get it, and everything just kind of falls apart for them, because there's too much information, too much stuff in one game, and it bothers a lot of people. It really, really does. I'm that way right now. If, if I were to get back into Destiny right now, I would have to get some of the expansion packs, and I would have to do a lot of research on what I really need to do to be able to have the game fulfill me and my needs as much as I want them to, putting that much money into it. And because Destiny is such an old title, old title, use that with air quotes, they need to have a game that is fresh. A fresh, new, 
start with Destiny would be something that it that would benefit Bungie and Activision tremendously with this time period. But do a little bit of this research on your own. There's a lot of really good information out there showing that Bungie really, really is starting to push a second game when it comes to Destiny. All right, guys, so I hope you liked the video. Leave a like, leave a subscription. It really does help me out. I will see you guys later.